Okay, so then this book is called, this is from, I think, fifth grade when we did a writing workshop over summer break. Um, this one is called Bob and His Unfinished Talents. Um, our challenge was to write a story around a random magazine clip and clipping. And this was my clipping. And I decided to name him Bob. So this is Bob and his unfinished talents. Oh, that's what I'm saying. I'm Bob. Dedicated to my best buddies, Philip Weldy, Ryan Tyndall, Kyle Kozik, and Josh Brown. Best friends forever. Okay, so this one's a bit, a bit more wordy. I'm hoping to do this. Oh, what we can see while I'm reading. Not really. There we go. It was a normal day for Bob, but it was a different day for Tasha. Today was Tasha's friend's Elizabeth's engagement party, and as usual, Bob did not care. Bob is unusual. He always watches TV and cares about nothing but his hair and TV. Tasha, on the other hand, is energetic and nice. She is also a lawyer. Bob, get ready, we have to go, said Tasha. Huh? Bob muttered. Get ready to go, Tasha yelled. So they were on their way to Elizabeth's engagement party. That is Bob just staring at the TV, and that is Tasha. She is a queen. Look at her. <laughs> oh. And then there's this guy. During the engagement party, there was an evil man who was planning a scheme. He knows everyone in the city because he looks in the computer and finds every family. <laughs> He knows that Bob, sorry, he knows that Bob doesn't care about Tasha very much, so he figured if he captured Tasha, Bob wouldn't save her and that he would win. <laughs> There's that. Okay. At the engagement party, Tasha was talking to her friends and the lights went out. Oh, Tasha screamed. The lights came on again, and Tasha was still screaming. Bob, help! Ugh! The villain had captured Tasha, but just his arm, and she is getting stolen from the party. The villain took Tasha to somewhere she didn't know. I've captured you for two reasons. One, so I can marry you. Two, because Bob won't save you. Ha! Ha ha. If you don't marry me, I will simply push you off the building, said the villain in a scary voice. I'm already married, said Tasha. Fine, yelled the villain, and he pushed her off the building. Ha ha ha. So that is Tasha falling fabulously into the water. Not so fast someone said in a strange voice. It was Peter the superhero. <laughs> Peter <laughs> pushed the villain off the building and jumped to save Tasha. He picked her up. Thank you so very much, said Tasha. Say, are you married? Why, are you? Not really. They fell in love and got engaged. This is... Peter, the superhero, saving Tasha from the water. She lost a shoe and her purse. Um, Tasha ran into the party, grabbed a microphone, and said, Listen, everyone, I'm getting married, too, and you're all invited. But you're already married to me, said Bob. Not anymore, yelled Tasha. And that is how Tasha became a fierce queen we will not be married to Bob anymore. The wedding went on and Tasha was so happy. On the other hand, Bob was sad, but he got over it and married the TV. The end. This is Tasha and Peter the Superhero. Yeah, Peter the Superhero getting married.
them holding hands. Oh, this is Bob's wife Tasha's interview on MTV. And she says, I can't believe I married him. Or he, he, the interviewer asks first, what do you think about Bob? And then she says, I can't believe I married him. Poor Bob. This is their house. Um, the entry, living room, or Bob's room, the kitchen, restroom, slash den, and Tasha's room. And the mailbox says, the don't know. <laughs> this is me. <laughs> About the author. Jordan was 10 when he wrote this book and loved to draw. He went to a writing class for the summer, and he had an assignment to create a story, so that is how he got the idea for this book. Look at me. I remember specifically not trying to smile for that picture, for whatever reason. Um, this is... I'll read this. Whatever. So this is the thing we had to fill out to write the story, the characterization page. So this is Tasha's characterization. Tasha is her name. Date of birth, May 27th, 1985. Age 23. She's a female. Her address is 515... 51515 Woodruff Drive, New York City. She's a lawyer. Her eyes are purple. Her height is 6'7". <laughs> She's tall. Um, weight, 130. Complexion, tan. Hair, brown. Clothing, dressing up for parties. Unique features, nothing. Personality, very nice. Speech, normal. Behavior, in control. Emotional state, when Bob gets her in trouble. Her motivation is she loves to be a lawyer. Talents, she's lovely. Hobbies, working out. Um, her favorite food is vegetables. Her least favorite food is junk food. Favorite place is California. Least favorite is Indiana. Her favorite book is Nora Roberts books. And her least favorite is Harry Potter. Her favorite pastime is shop. Her least favorite is TV. Her favorite television show is Food Channel. Her least favorite is Spongebob. Her favorite sport is baseball. Least favorite, bowling. Family description, Bob, age 23, relationship to character, bad, occupation, lazy. Home description, big house. Best friends, names, Jenny Elizabeth, ages 23 and 22. Traits that make this person a friend, nice, nice, gorgeous. Now for Bob's character, is it? Yeah. Bob's characterization page. So his name is Bob. His date of birth is April 27th, 1985. Age 23. Male or female, he's male. Address 51515 Woodruff Drive, New York City. Occupation, lazy. Eyes, blue. Height, 11? <laughs> I don't think I knew what height, normal heights were at that time. Anyway. Weight, 120 pounds. So he's 11'7 and is only 120 pounds. That's impressive. Uh, complexion, brownish. Hair, brown. Clothing, blue. Unique features. He has a big zit. Personality, weird. Speech, like Arnold. <laughs> Arnold Schwarzenegger. I could see that I was trying to write. <laughs> I didn't know how to spell it. Um, behavior, wild. Emotional state, worrying about his hair. Motivation, he likes to be lazy. Talents, watching TV and showing off. Hobbies, TV. TV. His favorite food is spaghetti. His least favorite is spinach. His favorite place is Indiana. His least favorite is California. Um, his favorite book, he doesn't know what books are. Uh, favorite pastime is TV. Least favorite is shopping. Favorite television show, SpongeBob. 
least favorite food channel, favorite bowling, least favorite all the others. So him and Tasha are complete opposites. No wonder they didn't work well together. Um, his family description is Tasha, age 23, relationship to character. He likes her, but she doesn't like him. Occupation, lawyer. Home description, big house. Best friends, none. He has no best friends. And to summarize Bob and his unfinished talents, this is Bob and his TV. Oh, okay. There's that one.